This is your Royal Fidelity Business News. I'm Crystal Darling. The Atlanta Journal-Constitution Online is reporting that Delta Airlines has discontinued seasonal service from Atlanta to Grand Bahama International Airport in Freeport and year-round service to the Leonard M. Thompson International Airport in Marsh Harbor, Abaco, due to damage incurred from Hurricane Dorian in September. Delta Airlines said it will continue service to Nassau with year-round flights from Atlanta and New York's JFK International Airport and seasonal flights from Boston, Detroit, Fort Lauderdale and Minneapolis, St. Paul. The airline will also continue to operate flights to the Georgetown International Airport in Exuma and seasonal flights to North Eleuthera Airport from Atlanta. In other news, Hull Financial announced the launch of its digital financial platform that allows users to convert cash to cryptocurrency and store multiple currencies. It also enables the management of personal and business accounts, execution of transactions across borders, and access to security tokens and fractionalized assets. Hull executives say that the service is a natural response to a world in which banks and financial institutions are becoming increasingly mobile and digital. And in international business news this week, e-cigarette manufacturer Juul announced that it will be discontinuing its mint flavor pod. This year, the vaping market hit its first bump in the road with several states moving to ban the use of the product. Since then, e-cigarettes have faced additional scrutiny, causing companies like Juul to revamp its strategy. Just last month, the company announced that it will be cutting hundreds of jobs and that in total accounts for 16% of their global workforce. This has been your Royal Fidelity Business News. I'm Crystal Darling.